Hello everybody! Welcome back to another episode of Bowser's Minions. In the last episode, we completed some, uh, some... We completed some of Chickaluck Woods and we started, uh... We started making our way through that area. We're gonna continue now with more Minion Quest, aka Bowser's Minions. Let us begin. I'm looking forward to this episode. And... Professor Egad's research quest was added to the Bean Bean Kingdom. Ooh, so there's more to do. I see. All right. I guess we'll just go start with that. So so far we are in Chickaluck Woods, and oh, the, oh yeah, that's right. We also did find a uh, Iggy last time. If you can see down there, the in the little icon, that's Iggy. But uh, we did uh find him. However, we still have more to do. Like, we... So, besides the fact that we did find Iggy, we actually need to go save him. But before that, I'm gonna go up here and try out the level of Professor Egad's research. Okay, we got two units here. We got a Boo and a Tail Boo. Alright, I'll try to unlock both from this level. And before moving out, I do want to also create, like... Um, full, f full, fledged, like, teams of, like, all the unit types. Oh, wait, no, we don't have enough. Okay. I'll start making my way on completing, like, like I want a melee flying and range team, but I don't have enough, uh, uh, I don't have enough flying yet, so. Uh... And then there's this team here. I'll go ahead and put in Larry. Yeah, let's do that. There we go. So we got that. And that does seem good. And then here we just have this extra squad. Okay. Uh, no, sorry. Uh, let's go here and just do this team. And then we can hop into Professor Egad's research. Let me just double check with beans. I think we are all set. I mean, like... Okay, everybody's at a very high... A lot of the units are at a pretty decent level, so I think I'll just go in and give it a shot. Uh, and if you do end up liking the video, uh, make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and that'll be helpful. I hear there are a ton of booze in, in a cave, in a nearby cave. Alright, sure, let's go find it. There we go. But, uh, if you do enjoy the series, I, I'm gonna be uploading a lot more of it. And, uh, make sure, if you do like the series, make sure to subscribe so you never miss an episode. I'm gonna be going through everything in the game and try to, uh, try to get all of it done, including all of the amiibo stuff. And just, and I'll also do extra things in it, so, you know, there's that. So, if you do end up liking it, make sure to subscribe. So far, so good. I think, uh, there we go. So we did that, hopefully we can get a boo or two, or like a boo and a tail boo, I'm gonna keep playing until we get a boo and a tail boo, cause we need all the unit, flying units we can get, ow, alright, maybe I should've denied that, actually I'll rally, there's only two battles, so I'm gonna rally and then focus for Lord Bowser. And then the rest of my CP I'll use for denies. Got him. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So that's done. The battle is cleared, and we got a tail boo. Nice. Oh, very good indeed. Most excellent. Oh, it's Egad! As it were, I was gathering booze in this cave for my research. However, I was met with a most unfortunate fate. I fell down. Ouch. 
That's when all the ghosts within the Poltergeist 3000 escaped. Uh, surely you, you fine fellows understand the urgency of the situation at hand. He cut off Captain Guma, that's funny. You must bring the escaped booze back to me. My wondrous ghost research is the verge on a magnificent discovery. No, just... Yes, you'll want my full backstory first. Expected, understandable. My research began with a simple question. What is a ghost? Incorporeal, yet visible. Their very existence defies the laws of science. Of course, light refractions can be can make du even dust look like a living being. There was a time when ghosts were understood as holograms of a sort. However, none of them, none of these hypo hypotheses explain why ghosts produce shadows. Not to mention their for forbidding laughter. Science has no answer to for that one. I've pondered these conundrums for ages. Oh, the ponderings I pondered. These these factors inf informed my conclusion that ghosts are real, living entities. I could agree with that, at least in the Mario universe. I mean, I do myself believe in spirits and ghosts. Both... Well, actually, I do in real life believe that ghosts and spirits are real. And if you believe it too, then good for you. If you don't, then that's fine. Everyone has their own opinion. But in the Mario universe, I do think that they're like a living thing in some way. Because like you can defeat them and such. Which begs the question, how do we define a living entity? I feel re- I, So I researched and researched and researched. Still more. This guy's got a screw loose. Let's get out of here. Okay, bye, Egad. Ah, uh, but as well... Ah, mm, mm, uh, but as with all things, conducting research requires a fat stack of coins. So I decided to manage the Starbeans Cafe as a secondary source of income. Oh! So that's how it came to... So... He did, so, okay, if you didn't see the last episode of Superstar Saga, which I uploaded yesterday, then go check it out, it's a good one. But in it, we explore Bean Bean Castletown, and one of the things we checked out was Egad's Cafe. And, like, he built it, we did know that he built it, but, like, we didn't get any reason to why he built it. So this is the answer, he needed money for his research, so he built the cafe to sell coffee. Ah... But at last, but at last, but at last, but at last, the, well, ugh, sorry, the, the, ugh, skipped it, sorry. I'm afraid all of these things require still more coinage. Uh, speaking of fantastic machinery, I'm also building a time machine. Yes, mm, yes, quite. It shall be another fabulous addition to my long list of inventions. In fact, I can't shake the feeling that a new venture adventure is on the horizon. Okay. Cool. Well, we did get some level ups here and there for some units. We got some beans, and we got a tail boo! A rare type of boo with a tail. Getting hit with said tail really smarts. Good to know. Alright. Did we get any boo? Regular ones? No? Okay. I'm gonna hop back in and try to get, um... Let's hop back in and see if we can't get an actual, a regular boo. Because I would really like one to, like, add to the team. Alright, he's gonna do, uh, this. Okay. Da -da 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 yeah! Da -da 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 yeah! Got him. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Alright, we got some extra XP. Yeah, there we go. There's an actual boo. Okay. Here we go. Final battle start. And toss. Yeah! Alright, they're going to s rally. I'm gonna... This time around, I'm just gonna deny them all. Deny all the moves I can. Got him. There we go. 
Didn't even need to deny. All right, we got some extra XP. That is pretty good. Battle is cleared, and we got an actual boo. Nice. 39 experience. We got a flying bean and a boo. For Bowser's sake, they won't be frightened. No, really. Prone to mocking their foes and attacking from above. All right, so we got one of them. That's pretty cool. Now then, we can finally go back to Chuckluck Woods and actually continue on th with these levels. So we got Forest Massacade and rec Reclaim the Red Goblet. This one seems easier, so I'm going to go with this one. Uh, okay, so we got... Hmm. Got Koopa Paratroopa Red. Oh, there's red and green. Oh, gotcha. Because, like, we recruited a green one in the Bean Bean Kingdom. And then we also got a para beetle weak to their rivals, the Buzzy Beetles. Hmm. I mean... Okay. I don't want to... Th I do feel like an, a mostly ranged team would work. But I don't want to accidentally... But I don't want to, like, rule out the factor that they may call in for melee backup. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to leave the range team as it is, but I have this extra team set up. So I'm going to put in Captain Goomba. I'm going to put in Buzzy Beetle. And then all the rest is going to be, like, all... The rest of it is going to be all the... It's just going to be all the melee I can manage. Okay. I mean... Actually, did I say... I think I got that backwards. No, wait. Okay, I'm going to throw in all of the... I'm going to throw in all of the ranged that I can, and then put in all, and then put in some supporting melee. We do have one HP bean, and I'm gonna give it to Larry. So he's got 70 HP now. And then, I guess it wouldn't hurt to have, like, one extra... Having one extra melee probably couldn't hurt. There we go. I've got to also think about dismissing units sometime soon, but that does seem good. Uh, sure, yeah, let's give it a try. Check a look, Woods, reclaim the Red Goblet. Here we go. Oh, no, not these guys. Like, the character itself, the, like, the character itself is fine, but, like, I can't do their accents. I'll try. None. Wash, I'll be staying right here. None. It is moi who shall be staying right... Staying here. Sacra Blue! It is here on Monster! Cask, mon frere, deal with him! <laughs> None. It is vous who shall... Should be... Should do the dealing. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> um, do I have a say in this? Mon dieu! The mushroom with the flag has spoken! Come, come, boss, Cork. This actually, the, this is actually good news for dukes. We shall negotiate. Moi? We? Talk it up. Mano, e monsieur. Um, sure, whatever. Let's do that. So, do you know where Master Iggy is? Master Iggy? Interessant. Someone has been causing trouble in the forest as mm, of late. It must be the fault of his Master Iggy monster. Mm, if we wishes, wishes to con if he wishes to conquer the forest. Zero is, but on place could set up the camp. Uh, on place? What's that? Aha! We have gotten 
to the heart of the matter. A Zen exchange for telling us who's where that spot is. There is something we want Vu's to acquire for us. And what would that be? Oh, there it is, the green goblet. Be all the behold the captivating beauty of the green goblet. Sadly, the accompanying red goblet has been stolen from us. It is beloved treasure called the miracle of the Bin Bin Kingdom. Since it has been stolen, we are the laughing stocks. We shall tell tell Vu's where Master Iggy is if Vu's rescue rescue the Red Goblet. Monsters from on foreign land will Vu's agree to our terms? Yep, sure thing. One Red Goblet coming up. By the way, who stole it from you? This ma- malfiend who stole the red goblet was a red turtle monster with wings. That sounds like a Koopa paratrooper. All right, off we go. Beware the dangerous sanctuary up ahead. It is filled with monsters, many monsters. Have the caution and... Hmm? They are already gone? Yes, we are. We gotta go and save the red goblet. We can do that pretty easy, I think. Okay, so we got a bunch of red paratroopers. You know what does- I don't think, like- I don't think there's, like, a- I don't think that there's actually, like, um- Oh, uh, yeah, there, like, there's the regular green Koopas, and then the green paratroopers. And there's also the, um- red paratroopas, but I don't think there's actually, like, any regular red koopas in this game, which is kind of weird. Okay, there we go. Victory. And we're gonna get one, so... Perfect, and here we have all of these guys. The Buzzy Beetle is going to work against them. I don't... I don't know if I... I don't know if I said their name earlier, but I already forget it. Sorry. Deny that. This is the final battle, so, like, I may as well just pull out all the stops. Enemy evasion down. Okay. Oh, da, 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 da. Now we're catching up. Alright, like, they're all going to work on that cap- on the captain, but, like, we're being pretty beat up over here. Oh, there we go, never mind. Alright, battle cleared. And we got a paratrooper, nice. Oh, there go- there he goes, and we got it. The red goblet. Fantastic! The only glass that- that could glow with such- Passion is the genuine article. The red goblet has returned. Got a smudge on the DS. Sorry. Monsieurs from foreign land. Mercy Bar but Coop. Mercy Mercy Bar Coop. You're um, welcome. So, where's Master Iggy? Hmm. To conquer the forest, Vus would set up the camp at Mother Chocola. Chocola. Here, take this. It is a map to Mother Chocola. Or Chocola. Yes, things are looking up already. Let's head that way. By the way, they say those who enter the forest never return. Ah, they are gone again. <laughs> Sorry, guys, we gotta go. Thank you for the map, though. Um, Captain Goomba's CP increased by one. That's awesome. We got a Flying Bean S, and we got a Koopa Paratrooper Red. A harmony of heavy shell and white and light wings. Strong against spear guys and other spear-wielding enemies. Nice. So that's done. Okay. Um, that, that wasn't so bad in terms of in terms of their accents. Like I got I got. I got a hang of it pretty easily that time. 
Unlike in Superstar Saga, where it took me a while to, like, do the accent. Alright, so there we go. We have a full flying team now, except for the captain. That should change pretty soon. I'm gonna go back in with this team and try to get one of those things. Let me check what they're called. Parabeetles. They're para parabeetle. That's her name. Parabeetles. Okay. Again, I do a... I, I do actually, actually, a little more, sorry, I, okay, uh, I do want to apologize for, um, long episodes, I've probably said this before, but, like, I do want to get through a lot of the game, because it is pretty fun, so, like, you know, I do want to get through as much of the game as I can, so, I'm gonna get a parabeetle from here, and then we'll do the next level. Alright, so far so good. There we go. Alright, we're gonna get another one of those paratrooper things, and then... Here's the final battle. Alright. Ally HP restored! That's pretty good! so good. Alright, so far we're doing pretty well. We're tearing them up pretty quickly overall. There we go. Alright, defeated all eight enemies and we got 15... Oh, I didn't notice all of our allies survived. That's neat. And we got... Only a paratrooper again. Okay, uh... We did get a ton of level ups, though, so that's pretty good. Okay, I'll go into it one more time, and if we can't get the parabeetle, then I'm moving on. Because, like, we have a lot of other things we need to get... We, I'm gonna, I, we have another level to do in this episode, so... Last time, I'll try it, and then... Uh, so I'll try it one more time, and then see if we can't, like, I'll see if we can't w get one of them, or see if we can get one, that's it. Okay. There we go. Got him. Okay. Perfect. We're gonna get another... Paratroopa, here are all the parabeetles. We've got to get, the, like, there's eight of them. We should be able to get at least one, right? And this time around, to speed things up, I'm only going to do denies. Got it. If any of them, if any of the parabeetles try anything, I'm going to deny them. Okay. There we go. So far, so good. Okay. Got him. Alright, we win. Can we get a parabeetle? We can! Yes! Perfect! Alright, 44 experience, even more level ups all around. That is awesome. We get a flying bean S, and we get a paratroopa, and a parabeetle! A vertib a vertible a vertible flying fortress. Their bodies are protected by a hard shell. Weak against their rivals, the Buzzy Beetles. Gotcha. Okay. Uh so that's done. Uh now we've got this up here. This is gonna be the last level of the day. Like I do see a lot of new allies that we could get, and if I don't get all of them, then I'll focus on that in the next episode. So, I'll only do the stage once, just to clear it, and then I'll go back and get the allies in the next episode. So, we what do we got here? We got the Forest, Massac Ma forest Massacade. Uh, a lot, seems like a lot of ranged and flying, like a lot of range for sure and maybe some flying, so I'm gonna stick with Captain Goomba. Wasn't there- 
I swear, like, wasn't there a guy who was strong against, like, the... Aren't... What are these? Sorry. Hold on. Cancel. These are... These are spear guys. Okay. Uh... Yeah, I knew it. Yeah, they're... They're weak to the paratroopers. So... I could bring in some... If I really wanted to, I could bring in, like... A couple... Hmm. Hmm. All right. Um, all right. Here's what I'm going to do. First of all, I'm going to dismiss some units. I'm going to dismiss this level four Goomba. Hey, sorry. Thank you for the bean. Uh, I, thank you. Uh, oh, he left a bean. Okay. Well, sorry. Like, I think that I read in an article that they sometimes drop beans, and so I just assumed that he would, but, like, that was just chance. Okay. So, I'll dismiss this guy, too. Sorry. Firestalking, piranha plant, say goodbye, and left behind. Okay, thank you. So, we're getting some extra beans. That's nice. All right. Now, let's actually focus. We've got... So, ranged and flying for this. And they've... And... There's also these guys. They know the weakness of the ice bros. We don't have ice bros, so... Uh... Let's think about this. I do think that I want Captain... Goomba. Now, if it's ranged and if it's ranged and flying for the enemy, then we could do a melee and range team. That'll work probably. Okay, so then I'll just throw in Bob Om. I guess it doesn't really matter who I put this guy over. There we go. Okay. Let's try that. The Forest Massacade. Uh, let's go. Uh, thought I... S wasn't there, like, a green shy guy, too? Huh? Where did everybody... Every everyone go? Oh, there they are. Wait. How did you guys get ahead of me? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Come on, let's keep mo keep moving. Hey, watch it! Ah! That's my underling! Oh, it's Sergeant Guy! That's his name. Now I remember. Yeah, he's with the Elite Trio. Huh? Wait a hot second. His flag is gone. What are you doing? Oh, um... um being confused? Let's see here. Sergeant Guy is over there. Which means th so this one is Sergeant Guy's Shy Guy underling. Which means this one is my Shy Guy friend. Okay, I get it now. But speaking of friends, where are Goomp and Cor and Paraplunk? The trio has officially split up. Who needs friends anyway? I'm gonna go and join up with Master Iggy. Yeah, I'll make a name for myself, serving the great Master Iggy. Hey, did you just ungracefully laugh at me through your nose? Mark my words, I'm gonna become- I'm going to become the greatest shy guy across all of history. In fact, you should become my underling. Some of my esteem may rub off on you. Nah, I'm going to keep following Captain Goomba. He's good people. I don't really care whether I become esteemed or not. Huh? What? Say that again! I don't be I don't care whether I become esteemed or not. No, the part before that about good people. I will not stand for such blast and indifference. You will be my devoted underling, even if I have to take you by force. All right, here we go. This episode's gonna be like over thirty minutes, so I apologize again. But I do want to. I'll I'll do I'll make the episodes as long as I want them to be. Uh. So, 
I do apologize if they end up being longer than you want to watch, but, like, I'll make the episodes as long as I want to be, and I'll do whatever I want in the episodes. In the meantime, though, let's fight Sergeant Guy. Got a boss fight on our hands. Like, a, in some ways, like, a boss fight. Okay. We are tearing through them. Oh my god, that Kuma did, like, that Kuma did over half. Oh my god. The Goomba did, like, over half of his health. Okay. Wow, we are way too strong for our own good. Like, a battle to start. This is probably gonna be slightly trickier because of, like, all of the... Because, like, the flying up front. It's time! Time for what? Oh, melee damage. Oh, that's not good. Ow. Okay. I'm gonna chance it to enemy power down. That's not bad. I'll take it. Uh, I gotta, I mean, I guess I could deny one more thing. If, if the opportunity comes up, I'll deny one more thing, and then, like, I'll be done with CP for the, never mind. It, it just goes so fast. Okay, uh, battle three start. Okay, here we go. Wow, we are really strong. Got him. I'm gonna focus on denying this round. Got some more defense increases. Increases. I, I, I don't know how to. I don't know what the word is. I think increases is the right word. So far, so good though. Like we're tearing them up. Just like that. Okay. Got some more CP bonuses. T I mean, no, XP bonuses. Two CP restored. Final battle. Start. We got Sergeant Guy to deal with. I don't think I need to rally. Hey, we need... Well, we need backup. Hurry. Said the wrong thing. But they got some enemy reinforcements. Uh, I'm gonna chance things. We need backup. Hurry. Again? Okay, more backup has shown up. Ally pow up. That's pretty good. Let's chance things again. Just because I can. And ally accuracy up. That's good. Okay. Oh, wait. Did you see that? Oh, Sergeant Guy, like, shot out, like, a magic blast. Like, with from, a, from his wand. Like, he used the magic wand to shoot out, like, a magic blast. I thought he threw... I thought he threw turnips in the cutscene. I mean, okay, like, fine, fine, he can do what I, he can shoot out whatever he wants. Magic blasts, turnips, I don't care. Uh, looks like I'll have to recruit some underlings else, elsewhere. Those who can't work with others are doomed to mediocrity. Huh? What does that even mean? Sharing a burden with those you trust makes you stronger. Ah, uh, yes. That sounds true. Lord Bowser is the same way. Probably. No, definitely. Eh, what do I know? Hmm, I kinda get it, and I kinda don't. In any case, let's move out. Before we go, what was that thing you said before? Something about a certain Captain Goomba? Oh, that? Can't remember. What? Come on, remember! Hey, Sergeant Guy, what are you doing? Huh? Me? Come on, let's go. Together. What? Really? I... I huh? <laughs> Captain Guy... Captain Shy Guy is so sly, but also so smart at the same time. You recruited Sergeant Guy! Nice! Oh, that's awesome. So, like, could we get the full elite trio? That'd be awesome. So everybody except that piranha plant gotta level up. We got some more beans, and we got Sergeant Guy, an elite shy guy with big dreams. His cowardly nature is great for dodging. And that's it. Alright. So... Alright, so we got more levels up here to get done with. I'm going to do them in the next episode, though. So, uh... And then I may go back and try to get, like, these 
two units, but like they'll probably appear in future levels like this one here. So I'm probably going to stop here for today. Um, thank you all so much for watching this episode of Bowser's Minions. See you all next time. Bye bye.